The City of Santa Cruz Curbside Food Scrap Collection Program is here. It's a simple way to help you comply with new state law that bans food from going into your trash and the landfill. Single family residents' homes will be receiving a six gallon food pail just like this. The pail is locked when the black bar is rotated all the way forward and the ears on the lid are tucked in. This prevents animals and critters from getting in. When you are ready to use the pail, rotate the bar back and the lid will open. The pail can be stored wherever most convenient for you, in a garage or on a back porch. However, for many residents, it fits conveniently under the kitchen sink. If not storing the pail under the sink, you will want to consider a transfer container like this. The city can provide countertop pails upon request, but any container will do. Using the six gallon pail is easy. So what is accepted? Any food scraps like peels, rinds, cores, eggshells, seeds, pits, and even bones. Also, fats, oils, and grease can go into the pail. Please do not pour hot oils into the pail. Instead, let them cool and solidify. You can even add coffee grounds and loose leaf tea so long as there are not any paper filters. Only food materials are accepted in the pail. Paper filters, however, can be added to your backyard compost, so I am separating out this filter for composting. Any rotten or molded food can become scraps too. This might include old leftovers, a moldy piece of bread, or rotting produce. Please avoid large amounts of liquid. It's best to strain your soup. To reduce the potential mess and odors, try freezing your scraps until the night before your pickup day. On your normal refuse service day, you will simply lock the pail and place it out next to your other bins on the curb for pickup. Your food scraps will be turned into mash and ultimately become energy for the city's wastewater treatment facility or the scraps will become animal feed. A quick rinse and a shake will help keep your pail clean. This program not only helps to keep food scraps out of the landfill, but also helps reduce greenhouse gas emissions in compliance with California state law SB 1383. Remember that food is too good to waste. Thank you for doing your part.